Hello everyone, it's Kay. How are you today? So this is the 11th of November 2021 on Thursday. So this is a video session and today I would like to talk about the fake Senkospan A angle. Because uh, every time I talk about the Ichimoku and how to capture the trend directions by Kumo and Kijun Sen and Tenkan Sen Chikospan, um, I oftentimes mention about the Senko Span A should be angle up or down to see the trend direction. But today, I found some of the market shows fake Senko Span A setup. So that's why I decided to talk about this topic so that in the future you won't have this, you won't trust these fake Senko Span A angles. So uh, let's get started. So let me with my face and start right away so before that this is a quick disclaimer as uh, this is the video is basically based on my own experience and knowledge so when you take trades please do with your risk management and also if you can follow the guidelines and rules on this video session that will be great so um, looks like we have many pairs trending today as per daily charts. So let me turn to the trading view here. And first, let me look at the Euro USD. So if you look at the Euro USD, this is downtrending. And that's why I posted the analysis on my trading views account. You can see this. There is the, um, there's my analysis here euro usd downtrending by ichimoku today but uh if you see this single span a it's pointing downwards and i say that this is downtrend because you can clearly see that the single span a is angle down and single span b is also down and kijun sen down tenkan sen down also and plus chiko span is below the candles and it shows that this is a nice and stable downtrend so in this condition, I look for the sell chance in the lower time frames, and I expect the market continuously go downwards. It might trace back to the Tenkan Sen or Kijun Sen, but as long as market is below the Tenkan Sen or Kijun Sen, then I can say that this is still bearish. So this is exactly the market that I look for the sell chance. So today's focus is about the single span A. So please focus on the single span A and keep watching the market so the next example today is the euro cad um euro cad also looks good because single span a has been downtrending today as per daily chart single span b flat but since single span a is continuously be downtrending the kumo is getting thicker and longer and this is a nice indication for the bearish trend so this is about the beauty about Ichimoku is that the market has been ranging right now but we can see, still see that there are more sellers than buyers in the range market simply because the Kumo is sloping down and Senko Span A has been pointing downwards and the Kumo is gaining its thickness and also if you can look at the uh, Kijun Sen it's still pointing downwards so as long as the Kumo down Kijun Sen down this is still bearish in the range market but one thing in this case is that the Chikou span is too close to the previous candle. So once it touches, and if it happens tomorrow, then we can still say that that will be in the range market truly. And we, we stop looking for the sell chance. But right now, technically, the Chikou span is below the candle. So we can still look for the sell and expect the market breaks the range downwards in this way. So speaking of the single span A, once again, Tenko Span A has been downtrending, so this is also a nice example of the downtrend. So this is, I think, visually easy to recognize, this downtrend by Tenko Span A. So the next one is the Euro Sys Run. Euro Sys Run is also showing nice downtrend in the daily chart, as the Tenko Span A also has been downtrending on this pair, and the Tenko Span B flat. But since Tenko Span A has been downtrending, the Kumo is gaining its thickness and it's getting longer and thicker. So this is a nice downtrend too. And also this uh, Kijun Sen is pointing down and Tenkan Sen also pointing downwards. 
and we see the range market for one week or so so far but we still we can still see that there are more bearish uh, and there is a potential breakout of the support level here because the Kumo, Kijun, Sen, Tenkan are all bearish so sooner or later I expect the market breaks the support level downwards in this way and also Chikou span below the candles so it also shows that this is bearish trend so so far these are all true or all good confirmation by Senkospan A for the trend direction. So let me introduce another trending market for today, which is Pound USD. So Pound USD daily chart also shows that this is bearish because you see that the Kumo's down. In this case, Senkospan B is also down, and Senkospan A is down, and Kijun Sen Tenkan Sen both bearish and Chikou span below the candles. So the market has been on the consecutive reverse in the waves and I can see that there is this there is a potential continuation of downtrend in this way. So in this case, single span A angle, this is also good. It's trustable since it's downtrending. So these are so far all good examples. So what about the next one? Pound AUD. Pound AUD daily chart, if you look at the Senko Span A, it's angled down. And Kijun Sen is also pointing down. And Chikou Span below the candles. So this is also a good confirmation too for its downtrend. Um, Senko Span B is flat right now, but since we see Senko Span A down and Kijun Sen down, this is bearish. So. As long as market is below the Kijun Sen, it's bearish. So still there is a potential bearishness. So today or tomorrow, I expect the market bounces by this Kijun Sen and continuously downtrend for next week. So the next one is the pound AUD, sorry, pound CAD pair. So I'm just laying out all the trending market as per daily chart. So this is Pound CAD daily chart, and this is also nice downtrend. Yeah, you can see that the Kumo's down, and Senko Span B is technically pointing down, and Senko Span A is also downwards, and Kijun Sen Tenkan Sen both bearish, and Chikou Span below the candles. So this is all another nice downtrend. And in this particular pair, um, since the market has been bounced by this Tenkan Sen a couple of times previously. Today is bullish, but I still expect the market bounces by this Tenkan Sen and continuously be bearish in this downtrend. So uh, this is another nice example for this continuous bearish market. So, so far, these are all trustable bearish trend. So let's look at the next one. The next one is AUDJPY. And what about this one? So in this case, you can see that the Senko Span A is up and Kijun Sen is up also and the Tenkan Sen flat, Senko Span B flat but Chikou Span technically above the candles. So you might think that this is also bullish and you might expect the market continuously be bullish in this way. But this is actually the fake Senko Span A angle and the reason is that there are two reasons here in this case. One is the market is below the Kijun Sen. So when you see uptrend, the market should be above the Kijun Sen. When you see downtrend, the market should be below the Kijun Sen. But in this particular case, you can see that the price is below the Kijun Sen, although Kijun Sen is pointing upwards, this can be fake. So in this case, Kijun Sen angle can be fake, and also Senko Span A angle also can be fake. So in this case, I will never look for the buy chance. And also, I won't look for the sell chance because this is ranging. So we're not sure which way it's going. It might range for a couple more days. So in this case, I won't look for any trading edges. So that's one of the reasons why in this case, Senko Span A is fake, uptrend. And also the second reason why this is fake 
is that the uh, if you look at the previous single span level, A levels, I mean single span A swing high was here, and you can see that it, right now single span A is below the previous single span A level, and this shows that this is also a fake single span A angle. So in this case, when I see this market, I say that this is a flat kumo. I say that this is flat kumo. I don't say that this is bullish kumo. Well, technically it's bullish because it's the single span B is below, single span A is above, and this is technically, you know, bullish kumo. But in terms of bullishness, bearishness, I would say that this is the flat kumo. So. Uh, in this case, single span A angle can be fake. So there are basically two reasons why this single span A is fake. And once again, one is the price is below the Kijun Sen. And the second reason is the single span A level is below the previous single span A level. So in this case, if I want to buy until when I wait for is that I have to see that the single span A needs to be above the previous single span A level as the market keeps going up this way and also uh, if it goes up this way then Kijun Sen will turn flat sooner or later and I have to see the market breaks the Kijun Sen upwards and then in that condition I look for the buy chance because that's exactly when the market turns uh, its equilibrium from range to bullish market and then I look for the buy and expect the market goes up continuously in that way. And also Chikou Span needs to be above the candles if it happens. Um, so basically that's what I wait for and I don't think it's going to happen today or tomorrow. So basically in this case I just wait for, I will just come back to this chart um, sometime next week. So this is one of the fake Senko Span A example for today. And let me show you another fake example, which is shown on the CADJPY. So here is CADJPY, and this time you can see that the market is still on or above or on the Kijun Sen now, and Kijun Sen is bullish. So this part is good. The market is not below the Kijun Sen. Well, it's about to be below the Kijun Sen, but technically this is on the Kijun Sen. So uh, in that, that part, it's okay. And Chikou Span somehow is too above the candle, although it's kind of very close. Technically, it's above the candle, so this is also good. But if you look at the single Span A level, if you can see that the, it's still below the previous single Span A level. If you draw the horizontal line, it's obvious. And let me zoom in like this. And you can clearly see that the single span A is still below the previous single span A level. So in this case, what I wait for is the same as the previous chart, AUDJPY. I wait for the single span A to be above the previous single span A level while the market goes up in this way. And then I look for the buy chance. Well, in that condition, it should be above the Kijun Sen. So Kijun Sen. Uh, at some point, we'll go flat and the market goes above the Kijun Sen and also Chikou Span needs to be above the candles. And then I look for the buy chance in the lower time frame. Otherwise, I stay away. And most of the cases when I see this kind of condition, um, the market will, be, will break the Kijun Sen and goes into the range. And Senko Span A remains flat means that single span A never breaks the previous single span A level. It remains flat like this, while the single span B goes flat and Kijun Sen, uh, sorry, uh, this uh, Kijun Sen becomes flat and Henkan Sen start to retrace backwards and that will make the single span A be bearish, retrace. And also Chikou Span will touch and break the candle and then the market will be true range uh, mode free range condition as per Ichimoku. So I won't look for the buy chance nor sell chance if it happens. So this is also a fake single span A angle example. So 
Let's look at the next one. I see another pair, which is Sisfran JPY, is also trending. Aspera Senkospan A and Kijun Sen. So let me turn this one. Right, so in this case, you can see that the market is first above the Kijun Sen, which is nice. And the Kijun Sen is up. And if you look at the Senkospan A, it's up also. It broke the previous Senkospan A level and it's continuously bullish while single span B remains flat and also Chikou span is clearly above the candles so this is a nice uptrend still so there was a previous support here the market was supported twice and I expect the market goes up in this way but once the market breaks this level then it will become a head and shoulders and the market might be traced back to Kijun Sen or the Kumo all the way down this way but as long as the market is above that level it's bullish so I continuously look for the buy chance in this particular market so you see how I identify the difference of uh, the, uh, the single span A which is trustable and which is not trustable in this way so, so once again this is a nice single span A angle and Euro USD, this one is also nice. It's pointing downwards. And Euro CAD, single span A is also nice. It's been stably downtrending single span A, which is making the Kumo bigger and bigger. And Euro CIS run also it's nice. Single span A has been downtrending. And pound USD is also nicely downtrending. It broke the previous single span A level and now it's going down this way. And pound AUD is also nice. Single span A was flat, but uh, today it made the single span A level downwards and Kijun Sen down. So this is also a nice downtrend. Or I would say that the market is has more bearish, uh, you know, positions than buying positions, bullish positions here. So this is okay to look for the sell chance. And pound CAD is also nice. It's been downtrending single span A. However, if you look at the AUD JPY, you see that the single span A's angle is still below the previous single span A, and the market is below the Kijun Sen. And also CAD JPY price is on the Kijun Sen, but if you look at the single span A, it's below the previous single span A level. So this can be fake, and I will stay away. And the CAC JPY, this, was, this one's nice. This run JPY is bullish nicely. So this is a brief tutorial or brief explanation of which single span A is trustable and which single span A is not trustable for its trend directions. So hopefully in the future, if you look at the charts, you also focus on the single span A angle and also whether it's above or still below the previous single span A levels. So yeah, so hopefully you learned something new from my video today. If you liked it, please press the like button. And also if you can subscribe and click the bell button, that would be great so that you get notified as I do these video sessions, live streams on my YouTube channel. So hopefully you capture some nice pips today because it's trending nicely today and I will see you in the next one. So until then, please stay healthy, stay safe, and stay gold. Right, bye for now, everyone. Matane. Thank you.